What's going on guys? This is your boy Mr. 75 Caprizi with another video. Today guys I'm going to be showing you guys a little recap from last month's vehicles. I got them all lined up here waiting for all the new customers to come pick them up. Wanted to do a little video to show you guys a little recap. See what you guys think. Get in the comment section. Let me know which one is your guys' favorite one. And which one was a game changer for y'all. Like which one did a big difference for whatever reason we did to it or whatever changes we did to it. Let me know get in the comment section which one you guys like and which one's your favorite one. But I'm gonna start off with this white one, which is gonna be the 1985 Chevy Caprice Classic. This one we had installed 26 inch for Giotto, brand new. Sold this one to one of my high school friends. Pavement's a little uneven, so it's not going to show you the correct height. So yeah, this one, the car's a little sitting crooked, so yeah, you guys can see the gap. But the rear does got air shock, so it is adjustable. You can lift it, raise it, lower it, however you want it. We're gonna leave that for the customer to adjust at his height. But I think it came out pretty nice. I like the wheels. He liked the wheels. We are waiting on his steering wheel to get here so I can install it and some LED lights. And then it's, it's out of here. Should be bringing them either today or tomorrow. He's at work right now, waiting for him to call me back, see what he's gonna wanna do. Now for the second one, we have this 1990 Chevy Caprice Classic. We just installed the 26 inch billet wheels. These are American Racing wheels. That's what it says on the cap. American Racing. So yeah, these are 26s. Just installed these. This is the latest pickup. We just got this last week, I believe Thursday. So we just mounted the wheels and we actually have a potential buyer out there waiting for me to finish his vlog. So he didn't waste no time. He's actually a good friend of mine. Been knowing him for a long time. And I was just with him yesterday at the car show and he told me he wanted to check it out. So he didn't waste no time. So I'm not sure guys if it's going to be available after this video. But it came out nice. This one got a nice shine. It's got red interior. Which makes the car pop. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I like how this one came out. It's pretty simple yet but clean and it just looks nice i like the wheels they look like they have a nice chop to it got a steering wheel that i bought too i haven't installed it looks like it kind of goes with the design of the wheels but i haven't uh, installed it because the wrap on it is tan and the interior is kind of like a red itch so we're just gonna Depending on him, if he's going to want to take the car. If not, I will be showing you guys the steering wheel. And we have this bad boy still available. Which, if that one leaves, we're going to be mounting up this one on 28. Since nobody wants to buy the car on stocks. Because we're going to have to slap some wheels. Or I might take the 26s off the dunk and put them on here. But yeah, this one is... Nice clean car, super solid, Arizona car, crazy music, it's got mats all around the car, it's got it on the doors, it's got 
a nice interior custom all wrapped dash wrapped big jvc screen got the flame fire screen wheel got the dakota digital dash got the sunroof yeah guys this is a nice car a lot of people sleep on it but it's fine watch we put some wheels on it and show you guys the magic this is the subs right there they're hiding you guys see them pretty nice pretty nice got a nice clean paint job not the best but it's presentable yeah guys this one's still available so if you guys are interested let me know pretty quick because like I said if it doesn't sell pretty quick here we're gonna slap some wheels and do a little bit more upgrades on it because I actually like the music on this car sounds nice sounds good it's got a large system remote star so yeah guys we already installed the rear bumper fillers right there they were missing so those are installed this one right here it's not for sale guys this is my buddy's car that's a 1990 i last broke him for some reason like the 90s came with this oh it's locked i wonder where it's locked they came with that reddish color interior i always love this car I told him if he sells it he gotta buy it right here so yeah this one's got the tiara grill in the front 26 inch rose gold for Giotto brush with the matching steering wheel so yeah guys this is a 1990 1990 1990 1985 see how the front end changes this one's got the euro front end both got the single 4x8 headlights and the grill changes yeah I'll show you guys the uh, steering wheel and the color interior I'm telling you that uh, the 90s have like that reddish color same as that uh, one over there super super clean car I like this car and then here we have the giveaway car Guys, the giveaway ends on the 18, so you guys still have a chance to get on this one. For those that haven't got your entry, it's only $20. Ends on May 18. It's got 26 inch Armani Forge. It's got dual exhaust. It's got an ostrich print quarter top. It's got LED sequential tail lights. Fresh paint job. Got a blue LED light right here. Got a sunroof. Wood grain, white steering wheel. Yeah, guys. Don't miss your chance. Only $20, and you guys might be able to ride this summer in a clean box Chevy. This is a 1989. Got the big nose, ENG grill. big smile and then last but not least the 1975 Chevy complete convertible with the 26 inch Corleone forged wheels so this one I was supposed to do some work and I had the car sold but we having, uh, I guess we're having second thoughts. So the car might actually stay with me. Still working, talking numbers with the potential buyer. But we still haven't came to a conclusion. So we're still working numbers on this one. But could be for sale for the right price. This is a... Uh, 1975 Chevy Caprice convertible fully loaded got a big block engine 
all power options got the power seats tail steering wheel power windows and all that good stuff I don't know. I don't know if I want to sell this bad boy. And this right here is my buddy. What's up, bro? What you thinking? You, you, you thinking hard or what? I'm thinking hard. I like it. Man, you know after they see this video, they're going to be in my comments. But I mean, hey, no pressure right here, man. I'm giving them an option, you know. Which one's your favorite from all of these? I like the white LS. The white LS? Yeah, the gym yeah, right? He had it for a while. A lot of people tried buying it and he just... I think he's scared that he sells it and he's not going to find another one. For sure. But I think that's accurate because, man, the way these prices are for these cars, I don't think you can, you know, find another one at least for like what he got into it. Yeah guys, I'm gonna wrap this up already. Just wanted to show you guys a little recap about last month's purchases. So just don't forget, get on the comment section, let me know what you guys think, which one you guys like the most, and which one was a little game changer. And for those that haven't subscribed, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, hit the like button. We got more coming. Hopefully we do a little bit better this month. Thanks for watching.